see if I got any better since last time and now I actually have a the right stance. the hits. Find a nice. That's a kick ass knife, man. Let me get my hand. Bell. Up. Bell on the end. Who is this? Who made this thing? Omnivore Blade Works. Jared. Omnivore? Omnivore Blade Works. This is awesome. Dude, and his new ones are so nice. Like, really. You know what I want? Cool. I want Jason Browse to make something for chopping. Like, like this. That would be fun. I'm putting that challenge out there for Jason. He make could come up with some really he serious. He could do something insane. Just a nice flat ground or convex or something on it. Be insane. Yeah, he has some really nice design. I think he would. He, he could do something nice. <laughs> I think I'm gonna hit myself with the saw bag. Barely even hitting it either. Is it a two hand? And that's five times. Being trained by Gavco do this better. That's nuts. This thing's insane. It's fun. It's some hard wood. It is hard, yeah, that's that's pretty hard. It doesn't look like hardwood, but it is pretty hard. My, the, my knife does pretty damn well with it. Where yeah, is it? the machete. Where is it? Your machete? Show them like the comparison here. It's ridiculous for such a thing. Yeah, machete it's I, it just it's weird to me. I don't know much about it because it's thin so it will have a really good bite. Oh, missed it. Only difference what the machete will have hard time with is the you know breaking okay. out of wood to, to actually break it to chip it. Yeah, and that's lacking. But that nice that machete is nice. Now Sebastian is gonna have some fun with it. He never had this knife before. You never did, no? no. Like you never worked with it. You no. held it, but you never worked with it. So he's gonna have a go at it. Like you see, I've seen, I've went through it really quick. What do you hold it, man? Like I actually, when I do the power chopping here, two hands are nice. Two hands. You can put a lot of power. You gotta hit in the right place yeah, too. And Sebastian, you wanna go a little on the angle? On the angle. It helps you. To throw the chips better and better penetration.
and now change the angle a little bit so you're gonna be coming from this way that's gonna make it easy so you don't chop across the whole thing you come and you're gonna chop like this Came to a very, very narrow space. Good. Almost there. There you go. <laughs> you can put a lot of power into the two hand with this one. It just works with this one. And if you notice where it stuck, sticks, this area here you want to go. If you hit here, it bounces over a lot mm -hmm. because it just it's back right at the beginning. Yeah, exactly. Close to the. It just works for chopping. That's the sweet spot on this one. For powering through, you can use the the front. Piece of paper. This knife has not been tracked since I got it, and it did a lot of work. This is like a notebook paper. I'm actually probably a little too ambitious because this knife really did do a lot of work. Oh, actually no. <laughs> That's actually <laughs> this is only 10.95, but it's special heat. It is uh, just o, o tempered. I think it's called. It's only 52.53 HRC. Which is really low, but it's it's better than even the three V stuff I used. It's, it's amazing. I don't know how he does it, what's involved. I have no idea about the metallurgy, but it's amazing. This thing is still so sharp. It has uh, over a year. Oh, it's almost a year. Almost a year, and it chopped. It has hours and hours of chopping in it. But it's not just. The, it's the heat drill what he does. That's that's what it does the. Normally 1095 would no, never stay this sharp. Not not after the amount of chopping I did with this. It's incredible. Right? You, you feel it, it's yeah. still sharp. I freaking put down trees with this. Two by fours, everything. <laughs> 